While breast cancer survival rates are getting better every year and the disease is ever more successfully treated, those two words do strike fear into women everywhere. Helen Carroll has big news of an innovation in the diagnosis of breast cancer. Helen. Well, I'm here in Galway with Professor Michael Cairn, Cancer Centre Director and Professor of Surgery. Michael, breast cancer is the most common form of cancer among women in Ireland. Yes, Helen, breast cancer is the commonest cancer in women. It affects about 3,500 women a year in this country. And we have a fantastic screening tool, mammography. Yep. It's great, but it's not perfect? Yes, absolutely. Um, mammography saves lives, but um, unfortunately, it's not effective in picking up all breast cancers particularly in younger women with denser breasts um, and in people with lobular breast cancer, the second commonest type of breast cancer. And to address those issues here in Galway, there's a world's first trial using new screening technology. Tell me about that. Well, this is uh, Wevelia, which is the use of uh, low-dose electromagnetic radiation um, to pick up um, breast cancer. And it... Um, We've done an initial study in it a couple of years ago that's very effective. This is the second um, device now, and uh, we're very hopeful that it will add value in detection of breast cancer. Now, earlier we caught up with a patient who was screened using this device, uh, Kira Adams Kelly. Let's have a, have a listen to what Kira had to say. My mum was diagnosed uh, 16 years ago and she was quite young, she was still in her 50s pre-menopause and because of that I've been checking myself every month. 13 months ago I found a lump in the breast and obviously was worried and it turned out to be a cyst and they warned me if I feel a lump again just come straight back don't just assume it's a cyst and this time I went back and under the cyst there was a lump and that's the breast cancer they found. Because I am young pre-menopause the mammogram doesn't pick up lumps as easily because your breast tissue is different. I'm very hopeful because this scan is so gentle it will encourage more people to get scanned and pick up that breast cancer early and get cured earlier and prevent anything reoccurring. Michael, a lot of women will be very interested in hearing how comfortable the screening method is. How soon will it be available to people? Unfortunately, this is at a very early developmental stage. So we've got this a prototype device um, and it's going to be a long time before we have this fully functional for use in breast programmes. You're very lucky here in Galway. It's the grounds of a university, it's also the grounds of a hospital. And when those two combine, it can be the best outcome for patients. Yeah, the breast unit here, I, I think, is a very good example of bringing clinical and academic programmes together. Uh, we have a very strong research programme and that derives the best clinical outcomes for people. Um, here in Galway, we have the LAM Institute for Translation Science, the National Breast Cancer Research Institute, which supports our programmes. And then combining clinical, academic, innovation with industries we have here, I think is very promising. Very promising. And another world's first from Galway tonight, back to you in Dublin.